For the past two months, I've been living in Athens, Greece, doing a semester abroad halfway across the globe from tiny little Grove City College. I had no idea what to expect coming here. The birthplace of modern democracy. I knew I wanted to visit a couple places, you know, the, the Acropolis, see the Parthenon, go to a couple islands maybe. It wasn't until after a couple weeks in that my fairy tale expectations of the city came to an end. Athens is a beautiful city in every unexpected way possible. You see, Greece has been struggling financially since the second half of the last decade. And it really shows. Buildings are old here. Construction doesn't seem to be a thing. And traffic is the most disorganized, organized thing ever. And people aren't necessarily euphoric about it. People are often triggered and annoyed by the simplest of things. And the Greeks have a bad reputation of being lazy. But I found that to be completely false. You see, when we think of a good life in America, we think of a life filled with success, money, expensive clothes, cars, and a perfect family. The American dream tends to praise an individualistic lifestyle. Greeks, on the other hand, value their relationships way more than they value wealth. To them, a perfect life is a carefree, stress-free life spent with all their loved ones. And despite the country's economic status, the Greeks are some of the warmest, friendliest people that I have ever met. This trip has been filled with amazing new friendships and experiences. But it has also been filled with a lot of self-reflection. Coming to Athens, I expected to discover new places. Meet new people. And experience new adventures. But one thing that I never expected was to discover myself. <laughs>